The more time you spend alone with yourself, the more time that you will be able to understand who you are. When I mean understand who you are, I'm talking about without any outside interference, without any friends, without any uh, peer pressure of wanting to be like someone else. The more time you spend alone, you're going to figure out, okay, what your purpose is. And I say that because of this. God will talk to you. Uh, You start seeking in those moments of not having any outside distractions. What happens is things become clear. Clarity sets in. And you're able to make decisions not based on what you saw that day or what you heard that day or what that person may have said to you. You're able to make decisions based on... You've got to want it as bad as you want to breathe. And if you want it that bad, if you're willing to give it that much, you get a big piece of what you want. And life and dreams do come true. Anything you want can happen and become a reality. I believe that sincerely, and I'll die on that thought, okay? And I say that not from something I read, that's from something I lived. I'm not talented. It was life and death. Either you live or you die. Which one do you want, Tom? That was the decision. In the corporate life and in the gym. But if you want something bad enough, if you want something bad enough, you can't let anybody tell you you can't do something. I'll repeat that. If you want something bad enough, you can't let anybody tell you you can't do something, not even yourself. A lot of days I'm like, oh, you can't do this, Tom. You can't be as quick as a 30-year-old on the computer. Oh, shit. Let me show you. I mean, I I would have arguments with myself. I could do it. People doubted me. I doubted myself sometimes. You obviously don't fucking want it bad enough. Because a person that you want to... I became obsessed. I became obsessed with being the baddest motherfucker that God ever created. Am I that? I don't care. I believe it. And I was trying to tell him, once you become obsessed with something, obsessed, it's okay to be unbalanced for a while. It's okay. Don't be, all this stuff people say, you got to be balanced. To be the best in the world at what you do. It's not about being a Navy SEAL, people. The best at what you do, you have to be unbalanced to find every bit of fucking energy and strength that you have to pull it off. Then you get balanced once you become great. And then you help other people become better from you being the best in the world. So if your family doesn't understand, why are you so daggone crazy? Because I'm trying to be the best I can to give you the best that I am.